You know, my favorite thing probably overall is making my team you know, feel proud and, and, and like the win and know that they can step behind me and I'm going to make a big play for them. He is uh, one of the most elusive kids out in space. Uh, not only that, his instincts, I think. You know, he knows where to run, when to cut, how to set up moves, and, uh, you know, then he has the burst to get through the hole if it's there. So uh, he has done some incredible things out in space. He's very quick. His agility is really quick, and he's got track speed. When I get the ball in my hands, everything just kind of goes blank, and I just my body kind of takes over for me, you know. I'll make a cut, and then I'll look on film, and I won't even remember doing that. So it's just... I guess I'm blessed with that kind of ability that I just, when I get in the game, my mind kind of takes over for me and I just do what I need to do and what I'm taught to do. Some of the best hands I've ever seen. Um, you know, some of the catches I see him make one-handed. He runs great routes. He understands, you know, where the routes are going to, where he needs to break the routes off at and, uh, and, and how to find the open areas. The first thing I'm going to do is make sure that I catch the ball. And then after that, you know, it's just kind of, doing my thing when I get the ball, just try and make people miss and, and go upfield. I think he understands what the defense is trying to take away and what we have to take advantage of from the defense. So, you know, he relies first of all on his knowledge of the game and knowing where we, we want to run the ball and, and he gets us out of bad plays and gets us into good plays. I see that he could play quarterback in a, in a running offense uh, very easily. Uh, but he is elusive and dangerous out on the edge. The number one thing I want to do is, is keep my players confident and make sure that they can count on me to make a big play for them and, and just stand behind them no matter what. You know, he's a quarterback, he's a receiver, he's a kick returner. You have someone that can run the ball, who can throw the ball, who can catch it, and then who could also go over there and play defense. You know, that's a, that's a big uh, attribute to our program. He can definitely kick. Um, you know, that 47-yarder in a playoff game, and it was, you know, in November, it's a little cold. Uh, you know, that's, that was a big kick for us. It's a lot of individual stuff. It's a lot of mindset. With the high jump and the long jump, it's, it's an individual sport. It really helps me focus. And then when I have that on the track and I come out and bring it onto the football field, it's the same concept. I really need to focus on what I need to do. And if everyone's focusing on what they need to do individually, then it all comes together. So that helps me a lot with my focus. I've definitely seen great maturity in his leadership. He's very exciting. He um, is a good leader, and uh, we work well together. When the game is coming down and the score is close, he's always the one to you know bring the game back or do something. I like to lead mostly with you know my abilities. You know, make a big play, and then they feed off that, and I just keep trying to make big plays over and over again. And that's what I feel like they feed off of more than anything. Because you can yell and, and be excited, but you know your performance is going to do more than anything. You know, I, I love having all the things to do. You know, the more I have on myself, it, it forces me to play better, and I like it.